Now, thank you. We seem to be saying those words a lot at the moment, don't we? And these people have been described as the unsung heroes of the coronavirus outbreak. Look North have been following a bin crew in Leeds to see the risks workers face. Leeds City Council say that since the lockdown, there's been a 20% increase in the amount of waste households are throwing out. I can believe it. Here's our social affairs correspondent, Emma Glasby. Never before have they had thanks like this. These refuse collectors in Leeds have also never been busier and now every day their job can put them at risk of being infected with coronavirus. This team has been on the road since 6am and will empty around 1400 bins in Leeds this morning. All the refuse collectors have been given gloves and hand sanitizer to try and protect them. We've been told that the virus can live on plastic, uh, it lives on cardboard and, and obviously the bins are made of plastic and, and members of the public do handle the bins and then we've got to handle the bins um, but we always handle them with gloves. It must be difficult when you're emptying the bins to yeah, keep apart. It's quite hard but we, uh, we, 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 just, we just get out there and do the job um, and, and keep the streets of Leeds clean. Only two of the team can be in the lorry, staying as far apart as possible. The third member of the team has to travel separately. It's a challenging way of working and with families staying at home, we are throwing out much more waste. There's been about 20% increase in household waste uh, in the last three weeks, obviously more people staying at home. The refuse crew, for me and for the council, they are the unsung heroes. There's a degree of risk involved and they've actually you know, uh, put in a, a phenomenal effort. So how can we ease the pressure on the bin crews and reduce the amount of stuff we're throwing out? There was a study done a few years ago in Leeds that discovered that a third of the waste that was in our black bins was actually food waste. You might think that that really needs to go in the bin or the compost heap, and that certainly, but actually I'll just cut that off, I'll cut that off and put it in a stock or a soup or you could roast it. For those of us who are spending more time at home, um, we've got more time to maybe think about stuff like that and, and look up recipes. The COVID-19 outbreak has really highlighted the workers we rely on. It's also been a time for people to show just how much that work is appreciated. Emma Glasby, BBC Look North, Leeds.